Those special operations units we see in movies sure look incredibly badass, but they pale in comparison to the real deal. It's time to meet the real-life superhumans, carefully selected and rigorously trained to defuse the most difficult situations. Let's salute the 10 most elite special forces in the world! What's up, Fagnatics? This is Discovery Amuse, serving up your daily dose of the most outrageous, outlandish, and out-of-this-world fun facts. Keep watching till our number one pick, because this highly classified troop has been part of some of the biggest military operations in the world. Let's march to the front lines. Number 10, GSG-9, Germany. This special unit was formed after the German police failed to rescue nine Israeli athletes held hostage by Palestinian terrorists during the 1972 Olympics in Munich, Germany. The Munich massacre resulted in the deaths of one policeman, five terrorists, and all nine hostages. The GSG-9, or Border Protection Group 9, was created to take down dangerous terrorists just like what happened in 1977 when Palestinian terrorists hijacked a Lufthansa plane flying to Frankfurt. In their rescue operation, GSG-9 was able to take out three of the extremists and seriously injure the fourth without harming any of the hostage passengers, all in just seven minutes. Between 1972 and 2003, the GSG-9 had completed over 1,500 missions and discharged their weapons only on five occasions, two of which were to shoot the attack dogs of the people they were arresting. If you think that's impressive, wait till you see our top one special forces. Number 9. GGN, France. Like the GSG-9, France's GGN was also created in response to the Munich massacre. Foreign experts consider them as one of the most effective anti-terror forces in Europe. In the past, the group was trained to negotiate with hostage takers, but as the attacks grew worse and worse, their response became more direct. They now use equipment that's on par with the world's best militaries, including customized rifles, infrared optics, and full body armor designed to block multiple shots. Some of their well-known operations include the storming of a hijacked Air France flight in 1994, which successfully foiled the plan to detonate the plane over the Eiffel Tower. They also took out the suspects behind the 2015 Charlie Hebdo shooting, brothers Saeed and Sharif Kouachi. And just in case you're wondering why they're wearing these black ski masks, well, under the French law, their faces cannot be shown to the media. Number 8. Sayeret Matka, Israel. The General Staff Reconnaissance Unit, commonly known as Sayeret Matka, is an elite unit of the Israel Defense Forces. Known for their remarkable hostage rescues, Sayeret Matka specializes in gathering intelligence and conducting deep reconnaissance behind enemy lines. In 1972, they freed hostages of the Palestinian Black September Organization, which were held inside a plane in Tel Aviv Airport. The commandos pulled off the rescue ops by going undercover as maintenance personnel to take control of the aircraft. In 1976, in another airplane hijacking by Palestinian terrorists in Uganda, the team's strategy involved using a black Mercedes that was the perfect copy of the Ugandan leader Idi Amin's personal car. The decoy worked and they were able to execute the rescue operation inside the terminal where the hostages were transferred. The force is definitely strong with these guys. Number 7. J.W. Grom, Poland. The pride of Poland called JW Grom, or Operational Maneuver Response Group, is not only trained in anti-terrorism and other high-risk missions, they are also dubbed the surgeons because of their extensive medical training and clinical precision. Approximately 75% of Grom are trained medics or paramedics. The unit's operatives are known to be proficient in at least two foreign languages, and the soldiers are trained in capture or kill methods. It's like Grey's Anatomy meets Mission Impossible. Number 6. JTF-2, Canada. Canadians are considered some of the most down-to-earth people in the world. But don't expect the Joint Task Force 2 to apologize for going after the bad guys. 
JTF-2's full capabilities are firmly kept under wraps, but we do know that they have the most highly specialized skill set in the Canadian Special Ops. They are trained in precision shooting, moving, communicating, intelligence support, and sustainment. Just to illustrate how inch-perfect they are, in 2017, a JTF-2 sniper in Iraq shot and killed an ISIL fighter from a distance of 2.2 miles, setting a world record for the longest confirmed kill. Number 5. Huntsman Corps, Denmark No, they are not tasked to murder Snow White under the orders of the Evil Queen. These real-life protectors are the Royal Danish Army's creme de la creme. Also known as the Jaeger Corps, the Huntsman Corps specializes in long-range parachuting, combat swimming, and demolition jobs. They also serve alongside the U.S. Navy SEALs and the British SAS. The screening process for this unit is so grueling, it's probably easier to learn how to make things float. The screening starts with a psychological test. Then a patrol course evaluates the applicant's skills in shooting, helicopter and maritime insertion and extraction, orienteering, cold water habituation, and survival. Only those who get a very satisfactory grade move on to the selection course, which will further test their physical and mental stamina. And then there's the parachuting and combat swimming courses. All in all, the whole process takes about 18 months. Number 4. Alpha Group, Russia Spetsgruppa A, or Alpha Group, is a standalone subunit of Russia's special forces that is said to be under the direct control and authorization of Russia's top political leadership. Part of their job is to provide security for the Soviet leaders against enemy special forces in times of crisis or war. Most of their missions are classified, but one of their noted operations happened in October 1985, when they were sent to Beirut in Lebanon to rescue four Soviet diplomats being held hostage by the Islamic Liberation Organization. Rumor has it that by the time the Alpha Team arrived, one of the hostages had already been killed, and as a show of force, Alpha went after the relatives of the militants and allegedly cut one of the relatives' body parts and sent it to the hostage takers. Although this version of events has not been confirmed, it's still probably best to keep on their good side. Number 3. SEAL Team 6, USA over the years, the U.S. Navy SEAL Team 6 has been involved in extremely classified and critical missions in Somalia and Afghanistan. They have spy stations disguised as commercial boats around the world, and they've gone undercover to gather intelligence on enemy grounds. But this small group propelled itself to legendary status when they successfully killed Al-Qaeda leader Osama bin Laden on May 2, 2011 in his compound in Pakistan. The operation took only 40 minutes in total and Bin Laden was killed by a gunshot wound to the head. Aside from this monumental feat, the SEAL Team 6 was also front and center in the rescue ops of Captain Richard Phillips, a merchant mariner who was taken hostage by Somali pirates in April 2009. The team's highly trained snipers parachuted into nearby waters and killed all three pirates with clear shots to the head, putting an end to the maritime hijacking that lasted four days. Number 2. Special Air Service, UK The British Army's SAS, or Special Air Service, is the longest active special unit and is one of the world's most renowned and respected special forces. Their selection and training process has an astonishing 90% fail rate and is designed to push limits and bring the aspirants to their breaking points. The first phase forces them to navigate a mountain range alone and within a 20-hour limit. If they get through that, they proceed to taking lessons on tradecraft, medical care, and hand-to-hand -hand combat in the hot jungles of Brunei, Belize, or Malaysia. After that, their marksmanship and combat skills are developed and refined. They are also put through airborne school. In the final stage, candidates are hunted down and brutally interrogated. Sounds brutal, after all, their motto is, who dares wins, and only the few who dared were rewarded with the coveted SAS badge. Before we go to our number one pick, 
do us a solid and make sure to smash the subscribe button and hit the notification bell. Don't forget to choose all so you won't miss out on any of our latest life-changing boredom-busting content. And of course, be sure to turn on notifications in your app settings. Number 1. Delta Force, USA the United States Delta Force is well-funded by secret government accounts armed with cutting-edge weaponry and answers only to the president and him alone. They can be asked to work for any department that needs them, be it the Army, the FBI, or the CIA. They are trained as professional assassins and almost act like mercenaries. It is believed that the unit's recruits must have a 100% shooting accuracy from 600 yards and a 90% accuracy at 1,000 yards. The Delta Force arsenal is reputed to be limitless, with most of the weapons customized for them. Their training facility reportedly holds what is called the House of Horrors, which include buses, trains, and even a passenger airline for their hostage rescue training. But some groups are criticizing the special unit, saying that with too much power comes too little accountability. They say the group undertakes missions that are almost beyond the military's regular laws. But for Delta Force defenders, the group's important role for the United States justifies the lack of restrictions and accountability. So, which of these kick-ass elite forces did you find the most incredible? Let us know in the comments section below. Take home any of our exclusive gear by browsing our merch shelf or clicking the link in the video description. And while you're at it, take our quiz to find out how you can earn extra cash online doing what you do best. Awesome, right? Know what's a good match to those elite teams? Some killer wheels, of course. So check out our countdown of the 12 most incredible vehicles that actually exist. Till then, stay honorable, Facnatics, and see you in the next video.